What's going on guys, it's your boy Bigfoot36 here coming out here with another video. And this is just a kind of a, a view of what I'm doing right now um, that you can get, get a glimpse of, of how I do it. Um, right now I'm just playing some Destiny 2, looking for a raid group, but I'm currently working on a another turret modification for, I just dropped what I was working on, for the light cruiser. Um, in this set it comes with bricks, with these uh, bricks. And I thought those were too chunky for the size of the ship, so we're working on something different. Um, just drop that piece. Sorry, camera work is just terrible. So we're going to be working with these uh, the light gray round tiles or plate pieces to make it more flush. But uh, that's what we're working with. Um, but yeah, we'll see what we come up with here in a second. All right, guys. So I just wanted to show off. This is what the uh, what I came up with the first. Um, this is all pieces that are included in with the set, all excluding the uh, round plate. Um, but obviously, this looks pretty bad. I try to reference pictures, and there's like this weird middle piece. But uh, right now, we got this going on. This is my finished piece with a little bit of creative freedom. Obviously, there are some red bricks that you can kind of see through, but I don't have any extra pieces that would match the color. Um, these are. My stop bricks that I used, I guess I could use, have used, no, I couldn't have, I don't have any. So I used some in the, um, in the front mandible piece. This is what I got. It looks pretty accurate for all things considering what I, to the, um, actual um, set or the actual, um, in universe design with this center piece here coming out, kind of protruding into around the cannons. But, um, yeah, these are all, oh, I did not. Well, hold on, give me one second. So these are all the pieces that you need. You'll need two of these um, stop bricks. Don't have to, obviously don't have to be red. One of the headlight pieces. I just got one of those um, light blue just for coloration differences. Two of these nipple pieces. Those, these are included in the set. Those pieces there, you need two of those. You'll need four of these pieces that I just decided to drop and plates and that, so. That's what we'll need, and I'll see you in the studio. All right, so now we're going to build the uh, turret modification. Um, in the last clip, I didn't reference that you needed, not reference, but just say that you needed this piece here, or two of those. That's also included into the set. Um, but now we're just going to grab that plate piece that we gather together. Put the four jumpers like that. My fingers are greasy. We'll grab our snot bricks, I guess you'd say, right? No, maybe not. Anyways, those two red pieces, I only have them in red. So that's, the only pe that's the color we got. Take a one by two brick there, the headlight piece up front, and then we'll take the um, same color cheese slope and put it like that. Okay, and now we will Take these two by four, one by four plates, throw them on the sides, and quickly run. These uh, grill pieces are the um, shiny silver pieces. We'll throw those on there just to cover up those studs. Pretty simple. And then those pieces, those big cheese slopes, I guess. I don't know what you'd call them exactly, but those go there on the back. Um, we'll take the uh, black nipple pieces, throw them on, throw the cannon parts in, those will go too deep, just like that, pretty simple, nothing crazy, we'll take the, um, would that be a jump piece? I'm not sure that's qualified as a jump piece, but whatever it is. God, my thing is really greasy. You can really see the grease there. And this is where the creative liberty comes in. And we'll just throw those pieces up like that. And that is the turret modification. And we're going to bring the ship in. Throw it on. It looks a lot more to size. In my opinion, obviously, everyone's entitled to their own opinion. So, the only bad part is that these do not so uh, rise up and down. They're a little fragile, but 
they're for looks, they're not for playability. That's why I'm doing these modifications. The modifications are not meant to be played with, really. They're meant to look better, and then you can display them and whatnot. But that is part two of the Light Cruiser Modification Guide. So, as always, guys, take it easy.